What's going on, y'all? It's yes and no. Back with another one. We got this Malibu from Chicago, man. This is the the cleanest Malibu in the U.S. right now. Like, and this at my shop. This crazy. It's crazy, man. Crazy. He'll stay customer did the whole car. This was his personal car. But uh, it is here because the owner wants to get the speedometer working and the fuel pressure working. I mean, the fuel level, the fuel sending unit and everything with that working. Um, the charge cable, you want to repair on the charge cable. I'm going to knock that out first because it's real simple and easy. Um, sending unit, I don't know if base broke it, it's not hooked up, or a wire came loose. I don't know. So that's something I got to troubleshoot. But with the charge cable pretty simple i'm gonna knock that out quick quick y'all see it here put some new terminals on it so we can have some lift on it ain't no lift on it Done. I can move these tools back. Charge cable fixed. All right, so we done under the hood. About to close this boy up. Uh, moving on to the gauges for the fuel. All right, so before I go try to take the whole dash apart type stuff, I'm gonna go ahead back here at the tank and see if I got a good arm reason for you know fuel tanks so let me go ahead and get that part Send the unit broke from the music. I'm about to drop the tank and we're gonna find out because it's definitely was at a decent reading and just kept going down, 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 down. So I'm guessing that's what it is. But uh Alright, so I'm about to do a continuity test. 
what I'm checking to do is make sure that the wire that I use and the wire that they use is the same wire. Let's see. Alright, y'all excuse the baby music, but uh that's the further diagnostics. We'll send the units back. So the thing was just up and down, up and down, up and down. After letting the car stay on, up and down, up and down, up and down. Uh it never said fuel connection open though, which means it's got continuity in and I did a continuity check. It's the same wire that they hooked up, uh same wire that I hooked up. So I was like, okay, so the wire is good. Got continuity on both both wires and off the the wire from the sending unit back. Did continuity test on both wires, like I said, from front to back on the wire I put in and the wire they put in. Cause I can't see where they put the stuff in. It's just it's too much to go through. So we're in my own separate, but we got continuity. So I should be able to hook that back up, put the center in, back in, put the tank back up, and everything should work. But uh yeah, like I said, uh when I put the multimeter on the sending unit, it's up and down, up and down. Five two fifty. It shouldn't go past ninety, so um now I'm about to just put all this back together since I can't, I ain't got nothing to do under that anymore. So I'm just knock that out. And then uh, when I get back, swap that city unit before I put everything in, make sure it works. Yeah, sure it be good. All right, we made it to the parts house. I gotta get some uh, microfiber towels. Every time I go here, I get like a 30 pack for like $7. Glass cleaner, some windows, washer fluid, and then check this scratch in the area. The map said they were closed. They were definitely open. So I'm gonna get myself. Get out of this place. How's it going? Let me uh, check the scratch in the area. Costs a little bit more than they used to, but it's still a deal. See what's in the scratching dent, baby. And a bunch of ceramic parts, fuel pumps. Ooh, this is like a vacuum pump. Yep, it is for some brakes. I might be getting something, something like that. Damn, that's not half off. Hopefully, don't nobody beat me to it. But uh, I'm gonna just keep looking. I ain't getting that right now. Damn, talking burgers. Damn, look at that. This should take an extra 10% off the, the, the lowest part. This is crazy. I'm definitely gonna be going. Look at the headers. This is crazy. Let me get the rest of my stuff though. And I just gotta stop that song for the like the fifth time in a row. It's cool though. But let's check it out so we can go install this sending unit and be done. All right, man, my phone about to die. So we got the new sending unit. On it. About to go ahead and plug it in. I did the own test and everything. Read correctly. So I'm about to go bolt this boy back up. Let my phone charge. Let it warm up in here. And then uh, put the whole inside back together. And I'll cut y'all along what's going on. All right, let's see what we got. Got the key in my pocket. See what we got. We should have about a quarter tank. That's what it's saying. We're sitting at. About a quarter. We wire back in. Hold on, let me go to setup. Make sure I'm at zero to ninety. Zero to ninety. I'm about to go put some fuel in here. That's what I'm about to do. Put uh, five gallons in here. And it should go up. But uh, it's pretty low. It's on an angle too, but not that much of an angle. It's all we get. So shit, anything out of that. <laughs> anything out of that, it ain't gonna read. Anyway. So I might just do two cans of fuel. I'm gonna call the owner and see what he put in here. But 
the I, like I said, I did the own test prior, and it was it wasn't saying zero with this. It was up there, up there, up there. So I'm pretty sure it's right to right. But if I put the fuel in here, it's gonna be hard for me to get the tank back up. So I'm gonna just put the tank up, put the fuel in, and then make sure it's working right. Well, I'm pretty sure it's working right. So I'm gonna pull the tank back up and then go get the fuel. All right, it's dropped down. Gotta get that fuel. But, uh, let's see. The adjustment. Uh, oh yeah, cause the tire wasn't showing. I mean, it ain't no crazy adjustment, but it is adjusted. You got frame notch on it too, I seen. I said, dang. Cut the light on. Frame notch. Yeah. The boy look good though, for real. This Malibu motivation right here. If y'all don't know, man, the two cars. I thought I'd get done with about three of my hood cars. G Body Malibu Coupe 768 69 Camaro. So, that's what I'm looking for. Something decent, though. I ain't starting from scratch no more. It's just don't, it take too long. And parts to be out of control. So, let me go get this fuel. And then, shoot, last couple boats. And then, sit this one off to the side. Because it'll be done. So, be back in a minute. All right, pumping the fuel, man. Went home, got some cans. I'm gonna have to get some cans for up here. Got the 93 going in there, but I don't drive people cars without them. So I still have to set the speedometer, but I'm gonna wait till he come back. Uh, two reasons, I don't want nobody following me to the shop and I don't want nothing to happen to the car. And that's why I don't want to tow the cars either. I don't want nothing to happen while the car on my trailer. So that's another reason why I was looking at that other spot. But you gonna get a couple gallons make sure it's reading right i think that's a two and this is a five so we got about seven gallons worth of gas 93 the expensive good stuff you know we'll see what it do about 25 dollars worth of gas yeah, maybe 30. so put y'all back on and get the shop I just need $23, but I want to at least try to have it to half. So I'm going to go one more, one more trip. I'm done. Everything cleaned up. Gonna move around. Get my wife car in here. Do this seat. Knock that out real quick. But my job here is finished. Try to get it to half. But man, I like this car. We gotta try to calibrate the uh speedometer tomorrow. Like I said, I don't drive nobody cars. That's not on my insurance. He could drive it or he, I could drive it with him. I just gotta be able to access the switch and then do all my numbers and stuff on my apps and then we could adjust from there and with the on the app so y'all stay tuned man we'll do that part tomorrow and then i close y'all out man this making me want to mouth away i ain't gonna lie to y'all this boy is cold this boy cold boy that's the three stage the back seats i got kids so y'all know i'm gonna have my kids with me here and there i like back seats but what I don't like is the food. Woo! This mug hard, boy. Hard. Hard. It's hard, man. Got that mint color. And I got about three, three orange brown interiors. 
all in that same family. My wife like, I do not want to be in that orange peanut butter family. You got the, all them interiors with that. And it's just, it's, it's a hit. You can't miss with that color. You can't miss. But yeah, we might be seeing some more of this car. Y'all just stay tuned, man. Man, just calibrated it. About to go. Everything reading like it's supposed to. Coming back though, upgrading batteries. Doing some excess piles, man. Them, them Optimus, they work, but shoot, they, they outdated, man. And they ain't what they used to be. So, you don't want that DM no more. Trying to get away from it. Yeah, man. Yes, yes, man. I'm out.